Okay. Let's see if we have any better luck with this time. Is it gonna work? Hey, there's a screen. Bonus is Johnny Struggles here. You probably know that. <laughs> We're gonna try this live stream stuff again. I keep having issues with it uh, freezing on me at some random point. So we'll try it again. If anyone actually watches, I'm sorry if it suddenly randomly cuts off on you. But we're going to try to continue our game and see how it goes. And let me see if I can start actually recording this so free the uh, stream stops and I actually have a recording of what happened. I had an awesome combat mission, well not combat, combat rescue mission and we got down to 98% damage. Yeah, so we almost died. If I didn't have the drones on a hull repair, we probably would have got killed. But it was a pretty neat combat. And it was pretty cool that we survived. We were fighting six fighter carriers. Uh, I was a little concerned. I thought we were... I was going to just originally just jump out. But uh, we were like doing some damage, and then we took a lot of damage. I did not really think we were going to survive, but we did. So here we are. Uh, sector map, what do we got? We got a rescue mission over here to do. We have everyone offloaded before. Contracts, is there anything else we can do here? Critical astro, I can't do that. I don't have any mining equipment. Yeah, I don't have a mining laser. Uh, rescue from another ship, sure, we'll do that. Was that to the same place? Uh, no, it was up here. Trade, it's, everything's plus 50%. Food, water. 1700 data, ammo's good. Slugs, they're there. Shells, FTL. Okay, one issue we had when we had a bunch of people earlier was CO2. And I can install two air processors per one CO2 scrubber. The issue is this is getting blocked because I can't I can't process enough of it. So what I'm gonna try to do is uh, instead of I just kind of threw this together real quick when I was building the ship. I didn't install it, the setup right. So we'll just install a buffer for right now for the CO2. So when we have extra people on board, the scrubber will push it into this tank, and when they're gone, it'll get processed out into the ship. So we'll do that for now. What else do we have? We have extra cannon in here. Yeah. Let's see if we can put that over here. Hmm. I'll put a space apart so there's a little gap there just in case. And I'll plug that guy in. The main line. And we'll put some cannon shell storage next to him too just in case we ex ex get extra bullets or extra cannon rounds. Okay, so do that guys. FTL, we'll go ahead and jump. All right, looking good. And jump. Okay, tacticals. Okay, here we go. And then fight the camera. What's this stuff here? Is there some resources to pick up? Ooh. Precious ore. Okay, cool. So once that shows up, I have no mining missions, but you can just jump here and get this precious ore. That's nice. That's some worth some money. Let's put it down the normal speed. And get this docked in here. I need to rearmor my ship. You see the X's on the view here. That's armor. And there's a lot of missing X's on the front. I just had the nose around the front nose and the f left and right wingtips, I guess, the fronts of them. And a little bit on the back. And you see there's gaps in the X's here, here and there. Took some damage. 
I'll zoom in a little better here. Oh, I can't do this. There we go. All right, we are docked. How many people? 33 people. My experience is going up. Looks like per person we're getting one experience on rank one. So another like 30 people will level up. We maxed out the cabins. We have a few stragglers running around. We're loaded up. Undock. We'll jump back home here, get these people offloaded and take the next missions. Do it. All right. Got 60 data there. Next bonus on data is, I think, 10,000. All right, delivery, let's get these people offloaded. I'm curious real quick, do we get any CO2 buildup on that? Yeah, just a little bit. You can see right there, we have 35 CO2. When these people start getting off the ship, they should go back down to zero. And that gives us a buffer instead of the CO2 being in the atmosphere. It just goes in this tank. So that's working good. Contracts, see what else we can do now. I don't want to do any cargo missions. I don't want to do any straight passenger transports, although 120 grand is nice. Rogue fighters. Five ships in the fleet. We can do that. We have more weapons now. We can take out five fighter craft. There's another one. Another five. Is that the same place? System 2. System 11. We can do that. And that's it. No rescue missions. Hmm. So combat. I'll go closer to the anomaly to get some more points and we'll go bam, bam, back here. See what new missions we get. Okay, a cannon set up. Friend jump is going to be an easy mission. We have more Gatling guns than we did before. There's four on each side. You know, four rail guns, two on each side, and then cannon, cannon. I need another cannon to put here. Uh, fuel, yeah, we have plenty of fuel. Jump. And data. Hostile contact. Where are they? That's the old battlefield. Okay, here's where I almost died. The old fighter launchers here. Are there salvage? Is there salvage to pick up? Yeah, there is. All right. I know I jumped out of here when I heard him survive. Yeah, there's some bullets right there. Cool. Anyway, let's go kill these fighters. <laughs> Weapons are hot. And these railguns are picking some of them off. Oh, they're hard to hit with the railguns sometimes. Oh, got one. Good night to him. It's a bummer is when like all your cannons and stuff fire at one target. Oh, there we go. The last two. He gets past. Oh, we didn't get past our guns. Oh, we took damage. Well, five hit us right over here. One hit. Okay, let's go over here first. Is there anything to see down here? All these little specks are uh, metal salvage. Not really worth messing with. Ooh, there's fuel right there. Fuel up there in an oxygen bottle. I don't know what this green thing is here. It's like... Here, let's uh, kill thrust. Let the bots catch up. What is this green thing? Uh, energy cell. Okay, you can't really use those in the game yet. Um, there's a generator you can do in the game, set up in the game, and you put the energy cell in the generator, and that'll provide power. The energy cell is like a small battery, but it consumes it, and really doesn't provide that much power. It'd be like an emergency, I guess. So right, there's no real use for it in the game right now. 
So while they're picking up those items here, is there anything over here still to pick up? Just scrap metal. Okay, I don't see anything. Alright, sector map. We'll go there next. Uh, where's my ship? There we go. And they've done repairs. Good deal. Alright. Okay, everyone back on board. He's got the energy cell right there. Some more bullets. Oh, he's got, there's more than one energy cell. There's another one. So the thing is, they got to come in here, put their supplies in, then they got to jump in the port, and the guy's got to come grab them to pull them in. So you're waiting, always waiting on the crew to move this stuff around. Let's speed it up here. Okay, two more. Last guy. Wait. Hang on. So there's one more deployed. Oh, here he is, way out there. He's way out there. There's another energy cell. Wait a second, is there stuff way out, way out? Because I fought six of these fighters craft, but no, there's nothing there. There's only three showing on the map now. Okay, we're good to go. We'll just jump. And plenty of data, getting a little farther away from the anomaly. Oh, hostile contact. Oh, we're out of cannon rounds with that guy. They're up here. Punch it. So this is a ship we've already rescued before. Uh, here we go. Ooh, what are these supplies sitting out here we can pick up? Precious ore. Might just grab that. Hey, we got one. Okay, incoming fighters. Let's bank. Get these Gatling guns off. Engage. There we go. Yeah, no match for the Gatling guns. Okay. Let's check this out here. So I'm assuming these are precious ore bits sprinkled out. Here, let's let's go ahead and do reagents here and let our drones pick some of that up. We might pick up a smelter to smelt it because they're like 20 grand, give or take. We smelt enough of it. I don't have any mining laser to actually mine it. It's definitely worth a lot of money. And I just already sprinkled about some might as well. We are out of some cannon rounds here. here. Three of our guns are out of ammo. Looks like we only have four rounds of cannon left. Four cannon rounds left. Let's see what they're actually bringing in here. Oh, scrap metal. That's not worth it. That must have been a destroyed ship. Or wait, let's just make sure. And usually the stuff sprinkled around things like this is the same item. Like, that's a different color. The scrap metal is gray. So if they just have to pick up some scrap metal from those ships we destroyed? Do they even show scrap metal? See, he's dropping that in here. See, that's a different color. Yeah, precious ore, all right. We just have to be close to some scrap. Right, let's make this go faster. Sector map. Jump back to the shipyard. We may just buy a furnace just to smelt this stuff to get some more money. Closer, all right. Prepare jump, Mr. Drone Man. All right, let's turn this off. Okay, trade everything's 50% off now. Every time the anomaly gets closer, these prices drop and the price down here increase as these supplies here get more expensive, more critical. 
and this is just uh, biowise cheap smelter 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 they don't have a smelter here well that's a bummer we'll sit on those items let's see how much it would cost to sell it precious ore is worth four thousand a pop I have one I don't know if I have enough to smelt to make it worth selling but eh we'll hang on to it we're not going to bother with a mining laser though we'll leave that off right now Ah, it's tempting to buy some more batteries. I always like having extra batteries. It doesn't hurt. Okay, we got. We can do another jump there. Let's see if we got any contracts we can go down there with for. Uh, there's a wrecked ship. There's a, oh my gosh, there's all these contracts for. Oh yeah, because people want to get out of here. Because the impending doom. Transport, transport, armor thugs, transport, transport. Wrecked ship mission. System 11. Where was that at? Yeah, all right, good deal. Let's go ahead and click that. I'll rescue them. System 10, sure, we'll accept that. Neutralize Pirate Gang. So this is the f fighter carriers. There's five of them. Uh, we're running out of cannon rounds, and last time I only survived because my cannons took them out. I don't think we could survive another one. And speaking of which, I need to rearmor my ship. So let's go to shipyard. Go to install armor. Let's rearmor our nose here. I don't want to put too much armor on because the more armor you have, the heavier your ship and the slower it goes. Just kind of do the edges. I'm getting too crazy about it. Front edges, leading edge. I'm going to go a little back a little farther on this one. And right here as well. Uh, on this side. Well, I guess it went all the way across there. It's fine. And let's do the tail a little bit. And the rear engines here. Corner and here's a corner. So not too much, but a little bit extra. Uh, armor helps with railgun rounds when railguns hit the armor. They tend to sometimes you won't even take any damage. And just deflect the railgun round. But it adds a lot of weight and definitely slows your ship down. And I want the ship to be a little bit faster and more nimble. Let's just double check that they don't have any cannon rounds here. I've already been here a few times, so this typically doesn't change inventory once you've been there. So yeah, there's no cannon rounds there's, and the bullets and railguns are what I have on my ship. Not that they have any. So energy cells. I don't need any of these. Let's sell all six for double the price. Let confirm. And we'll go there to do a rescue mission. That'll get us close to the anomaly and give us more data to collect. Get us close to that, closer to that 10,000 mark. FTL 13, fuel is still good, Fu food and water is good, oxygen is very good. Alright, we are we are go for go. Once that trade comes in. I'm going to take our supplies off, come on guys. I'm going to move the cargo from the back of the ship. I guess we could sell that scrap metal, but we'll wait. Yeah, we have enough precious ore to, I think, smelt that into one item. We'll see what that turns into. One more. Boom. Don't even wait. Just jump. Yeah, 130 data. All the darkness behind us. Alright, which which ship is he? Does this one appear? Yeah, there's a docking port flashing, so it's this guy here. I remember this one, this one exploded here. 
Let's speed it up. Uh, let's go right there. It's going hot. Oh yeah, slow down. Can't th use the thrusters real well with the sp speed faster than the normal speed. When you're on speed like two or more, it, when you hit the thrusters, it doesn't really do anything. Oh, come on, push. The ship's a bit heavy. Wait, is he floating away from me? Oh, that might be why. <laughs> It's like this. These thrusters aren't working very well. Let's uh, let's put some engine throttle into this. I align a little better here. Cool. Let's just use our thrusters to catch up. We got our engines at a low speed. Now we'll just use our thrusters to uh, match the speed to dock. Oh, back up a little bit. I need a button to adjust the throttle from the keyboard. I can't, I'm not aware of any keys to do that yet. Alright, we are docked. Good deal. How many people are we getting? 27 people out of this ship? I get next rank. Alright. Two times the humanitarian. Alright, we got everybody. Let's undock. Let's jump back out of here. We're going to be right on the... Well, I guess we're close. The void doesn't move as fast as it used to. FTL. Prepare jump. One thing they changed in update 2 is they slowed down the expansion of the anomaly. I call it a void a lot. A void, anomaly, black hole, that guy. Alright, contracts. Let's get these people off offloaded. Deliver. Armored thugs, yeah. Well, I'm not going to fight any armored thugs. There's only one there. I would say we might have a chance against one, but probably not. I, we would probably get annihilated. Especially without any cannon rounds. I'm going to do another rescue mission. Yet another rescue mission. We're just going to do rescue missions in this sector, and we'll see what we do in the next sector. Put on normal speed while that happens, uh, sector map. That, that'll get us right on the edge of the anomaly. Get us some more data. I'm hopeful in the playthrough we can get 10,000 data. That'd be cool. I've done it once when I was concentrating on it. Uh, it took a little bit. I got lucky. I was um, on the sector map. I landed at a star that was put the edge of the anomaly right at the edge of the star. And when I jumped away from it, my data jumped up a few thousand right above the bat. So that helped out a lot. Pro jump. Looks like our trade is done. Everyone's off the boat. Um, we will get fuel next time around. Actually, should we get some now? Because it'll be more expensive. So this price gets higher every time the anomaly gets closer. Well, now we'll probably be alright for right now. Jump. Because fuel and FTL jumps. Alright, 250 or 49 data. Let's go get them. Is this guy rotating as or moving as well? He is. He is not. That was just me. I wish you can speed up the game going doing these turns. It can take a bit to rotate. I put more thrusters on here, but I don't really have a spot to put them. For rotation, I got some extra thrusters on the wingtips on the sides there, but. They only engage for going up and down, left and right, not rotating.
Okay. He is moving forward. My thrusters get him. Yeah, he's going slow enough though. I can match him with the thrusters. All right, good deal. Meter dock. How many people are getting? Twenty-three. I was gonna explode in 20, 220 seconds too. All right, same deal. Undock. Let's jump to the map and get back here one last time, and then we'll hit these rescue missions on the way out. Pull Yui, and we'll be out of here. Collecting a lot more data now. Yep. Let's get these people off. <laughs> Unloaded. I can't let mine removed from gutter. All right. Uh, rescue civilians from wrecked ship. Is it possible? Is system ten at the end here. It is. I guess we'll just pick up a whole bunch of people and we'll make a the massive jump between sectors. Sector jumps take a lot longer. So if we have a bunch of people on board, that increases risk of uh, issues with CO2 buildup and oxygen loss and food and water, but we have plenty of food and water. We might be more concerned about CO2 buildup. Uh, so wrecked ship. Except... Uh, wrecked ship. How many people are going to be on a wrecked ship? This one place. I'm not going to pick up any passengers here. Or cargo. Look at these prices are paying. Everyone's emergency. Get out of here. Okay. Is that what's but these? So the weapons platform missions appear. So I have rail guns. I could sit back and just blow this guy up. But it could take forever. They have like, I don't know, sometimes 4,000, 4,500 hit points. It just takes for ages if I only have four rail guns. And I don't want to get too close to get hit. All right. So. Trade. Look, we, uh, we have to spend some money on some fuel. 260%. I should have bought some before. I'll just buy four fuel. Plenty of oxygen and water and food. So let's just do that. Buy a little fuel. We've got plenty of FTL charges to get us to the next sector. It'll be cheaper. Clear jump. 44,000 in fuel. All right. But now we should be good on fuel and not have to worry about it. And here we go. How many ships are we going to do here? One, two, three, four, five, six. At least six. That's crazy. We're going to be way overloaded here. Oh, and a meteor shower. I was not expecting that. Okay, we have a repair hull on. This is going to be interesting. Is anybody going to blow up? Yeah, this guy here, which I don't know which one it is. <laughs> How do you get rid of the screen? Okay, there we go. Escape. Uh, let's just go for the guy right here in front of us. That's the bad thing. is It says one of these ships is going to blow up, but I don't know which one of these ships it is, so... Odds are it's not going to be the one I pick. So, just under, what was that, five minutes? Just over five minutes. 300 seconds. Uh, this might be a little in interesting. Hopefully I have plenty of bullets to fight these uh, meteors coming in. Uh, rotate. Ooh. There we go. Come on. Nope. It'd be cool if this is the ship that's going to blow up. I said, I have no way of knowing. I've not noticed any difference of which ship will explode and which one won't. 
Somebody took a hit. Oh, I took a hit. <laughs> That's a bummer. Okay, undock. Uh, we should actually go the straight ahead because these guys align better for us. Full throttle. I'm going to go this way and just hard turn this way up to the docking port. This one doesn't... Oh, he's got one over there hiding. I couldn't see it. And let's do this turn. I waited too long. Dang it. Throttle back. Punch it up this way. Oof. Engines to the meters. That's not good. Come on, do it. Just pick this one next because it would be quicker to get to. This guy's moving as well. I didn't realize that. Okay. Sometimes it seems easier to get the ones moving versus the ones staying still. Okay, we are docked. All right, 29 more people. I'm interested to see if we get some CO2 issues from this. Eight, nine, okay, undock. And we're right here. That's bonus, we're right next to the other ship we need to get to. Ah, it's gonna hit us. Oh, we hit them, all right. Using the other ship as a shield. <laughs> okay, rotate around. I oh, mean, this thing, I need, I need some more thrusters on this just to rotate. It's too heavy for these kind of things. It takes too long. Once I get some cannon rounds, we can do some more combat missions, but right now we'll stick to some civilian rescues. Okay. Looks like we have one cannon round left. It's up there flashing red. Okay. Docking port going out. Okay, we are docked. 100 seconds left till that ship blows up, whichever ship it is. This will be our third one in loading. 38 people, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Cool thing on these maps, these NPC ships here, they take hits from the meteors as well, and they will get destroyed by them. Okay, we are loaded up, undocked. We took a hit right in the nose. Okay, next ship way down here. So we get this guy up here, and these two down here. So what should we do? We should... We're going to dock at this guy down here first, then we're going to turn around to this guy. Just thinking in quickness, if we got 53 seconds for a ship exploding, we might be able to unload this guy before that runs out thing is, if you're docked and the ship explodes that you're docked to, you can damage your docking port. I've had that happen to me one time. That happened to me the first time I tried doing a docking mission, like the first time I played the game, the, I couldn't figure out how to dock. And the docking, the ship exploded next to me. Scared the crap out of me. That was a fun time. Okay, come on, we can get in there. We can do it. We can do it. Going. Oh, come on, drifted too far off. Get connected, and then we'll see what time we got left. Okay, we're docked. Three seconds. Oh my gosh, are we gonna blow up with this thing? Oh my gosh, it was us. Holy crap. Do we? I, I didn't pay attention. Did we rescue. We got ten people off the ship before it exploded, and our docking port's damaged. We were venting air pretty badly. Uh, okay, they're gonna fix that. We're gonna go ahead and point over here. Oh, that was a bummer. <laughs> HUD, we get 27% damage right now. I, I don't know if we took damage from that or if that was from the meteor strike. 
What are the odds of that happening? Come on, there are six ships here. Okay, put their spacesuit on. They come over and fix the uh, docking port. Uh, atmosphere. Yeah, this is the atmosphere in this room is down because we have all these people in here. And we're venting air out the port, and it's fixed now. So that should stabilize it. Is stabilizing here. Right? It's building back up. Okay. Alright, we do have some CO2 building up on the ship now because we have 105 people on the ship. Oh my gosh. <laughs> These people get hit. Right, check this out. Stunned unconscious. That was loud. Stunned unconscious from the meteor strike. That's cool. Oh! We're venting uh, CO2. The CO2 tank was venting. Did that just dump it into our... I have no idea what just happened there. I have to review the tape on that. But our CO2 medium tank, our tank buffer for CO2 was hit and was venting. I don't know if it was venting out of the ship or was venting into the ship. Uh, too much going on. I'm curious, it was probably venting out of the ship. I've had a meteor strike hit a gas tank before, a fuel tank, and it was venting the fuel out of the ship. So most likely the CO2 is venting out, which is fine. We don't need that CO2 anyway. Okay. But it's cool, so things like that happen. The crew got unconscious, that's neat. The civilians, poor civilians. Alright, so 23 more people. And those 10 are lucky. Okay, undock, and we got one more boat to go pick up people on, and then we'll jump to the next sector and see how we manage that. Oh, we got lucky that didn't hit us. Okay, this should be the last guy here. If I'm not doing this wrong. I believe we hit this one first and then over there. This guy blew up too. I wonder if he got hit by meteors or if it was... He also had a time limit. No, it had to be meteors. He took too many strikes. This guy's at 96%. We might not make this one. Let's see if this guy blows up before we get there. Oh, 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 we saved him. Oh, what a cool deal. Coming in hot. No, oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me. Holy crap. All right, well, I guess we're going to jump out of here now. That's two crazy things. All right. Uh, FTL, let's, let's get out of here. I thought we had him. I thought we were going to save him. All right, jump. We're going to jump sectors. Jump to the next sector. Here we go. This is going to be a long jump. And you don't get data on the sector jumps. So CO2, hey, it's actually going down. It looks like it's going down. That's surprising. 128 people on board. Just want to check this out real quick, then we'll speed it up. Oh, that's not what I want. Go install so we can see the thing. Okay, so, yeah, this guy's doing his job. It's putting the extra CO2 in the tank. So one CO2 scrubber is good enough for this many people. But why did we build up? Now it's building up a little bit. I don't know. All right, let's... Engage ludicrous speed. Yeah, let's pause it. So we're up to a thousand CO2. Yeah, it is building up. Okay, atmosphere. So the bright green is oxygen, and the gap there is no oxygen. I think CO2 is typically a darker green color. So I think we're all right. This ship is a decent size. It can hold a decent amount of volume of air. All right, sector map. Where are we? We are here. Some hostels there. Ooh, derelict ships are always interesting for what you pick up. And then a shipyard. And a shipyard way down here. We need to go to a shipyard to offload these people. So we're going to go... We're going to hit this place here first. Check out what that derelict ship is. And maybe there's a goodie there for us. Maybe not. Ah, cool down. And then we'll go to that shipyard and get these people off the boat. And we'll keep an eye on things. Make sure we don't get any warnings about uh, CO2 levels being critical. 
I mean, we'll be fine. All our guys have spacesuits. <laughs> but the civilians would be a little unhappy. Okay. Where is this derelict ship? Alright, right in front of a small cargo ship. And there are some goodies here. It was a spacesuit. There's some boxes of stuff here. There's quite a bit here. I can't fight the camera. Okay, there goes the route, the bots here. I guess I shouldn't have parked right on everything. An FTL, we're gonna jump to this shipyard. I'm a little concerned about the CO2 buildup on the ship here. It may be fine. I don't see anything bad here on this grid, although I'm not an expert at this yet. Oh, cannon rounds. All right. So what's here in this box? A drone bay, a generator, a generator used with the energy cells. Uh, what is this? Sewage pipe. That's worth nothing. More cannon rounds, energy cell. I can hook up the generator and the energy cell so you can see what that does. Real gun shells. Yeah, we definitely need the ammo. Let's get the atmosphere overlay off. What else do we get here? Small tank, large tank. Ooh, a large tank. There's no graphics for large tank yet, but that's good for fuel. What do we got right now for fuel tanks? We got this one medium tank up here, which is damaged. Let's, uh... Thinking... Install a large tank right there for fuel. Go ahead and prepare jump and let these drone guys do their job here. I'm gonna speed this up. I got a little bit to do here. Need to buy some more drones. Could probably use a couple more crew to handle this stuff here. I'm just waiting on the crew to move manage the material here, going in and out. In and out. Another FTL round or charge. So two's getting close to two thousand, but again, I don't see it being an issue here. Everyone's milling about in the front. Oh wait, is the CO two? Is this the number? No, it says two thousand in the tank. And it says eighteen hundred here. Huh. I was wondering if this number here in this tank related to this. It might. So it might be good because this tank is holding CO two and. Is storing it instead of it being in the air. That's probably what's happening. This number is mostly... This number, I don't know. But it's probably fine. Like I said, there's usually like a dark green line that shows up on here for CO2. And I'm not seeing that. Okay, everyone's on board. Let's jump. A little more data. We're going to jump back to the other salvage and see what it's what's there. Contract. Let's get these people off off our ship. One, two, three, four. That should be like four and a half. Yeah. And ten. <laughs> ten people. Cargo, cargo, and civilians from our ship. We'll do the rescue. I like another combat mission. So trade. What do they have for trade? Oh yeah, we want to repair our ship. Undo that. Trade. We want some more drones. Let's buy them all. Crew. Let's see. We have 15 crew. Let's go ahead and buy. Hire five more crew. And we picked up a spacesuit in that last salvage. We'll pick. We'll have to buy four more spacesuits. Fuel is cheap. We're gonna buy a bunch of fuel. Because we are at a thousand fuel. I wasn't paying attention. We about ran out of gas. Confirm. Just go ahead and get that trade entered in to get the material on board. I'm going to go buy all of it, actually. Energy cells. We have one. Uh, I might hook that up. I'm going to buy all the FTL charges while it's super cheap. I'm going to buy all the bullets. All the railgun slugs. There have no cannon rounds here, either. That's a bummer. Let's 
food. There's no food. Compost. We're going to get rid of our compost. Do they have a smelter here? They have a smelter. We'll buy this one smelter. Uh, let's check everything out real quick. Need another cannon. Go ahead and buy it at full price. Confirm just to get the ship set up the way I want. Okay, lots of trades coming. Next place I want to go is this derelict here, the one with this rescue mission and hostiles. We'll fight them and then head back to our shipyard. Sounds like a plan. Okay, install a generator. There we go. And we'll just put it, where can we put it? As an experiment. Let's put it up here. Slow down. I've got a trader. There's batteries here. There are no batteries here. Let's get normal speed. Let's remove one of our batteries. I'm going to install it next to this guy here and we'll just charge the battery with it as an example. Okay, install. We don't need this extra drone, but we could probably sell it. Smelter. Let's put our smelter over here. Yeah, like so. Plug him in so he can smelt the precious ore we got. Make some, make a little bit of money there. What else do we have? Extra scrubber. Oh, we got another large tank. Awesome. Was not expecting that. I might have put him like this then. And move that door over. That's all good. Right there, pipe it up. <clears throat> so we have massive fuel tanks now. I'm tempted to we'll just delete this medium tank here. Even though he's got fuel in it, I hate to do it. Mark him for removal. I'll lose that fuel. Okay, is he... Okay, installed it. Alright. And once it powers up we can cycle through its uh, setup here. So it says metal ingot, click on it, refined tilium, click on it, precious metal. Alright, we wanted the refined precious metal. Battery's been uninstalled. And see right here you can see the energy cells already been put on it. Do that. Our cable to it. So once the battery's installed this should go into the battery, I'm assuming. I've messed with these before, but it's been a while. So I can't guarantee it's going to do that. But here we go, we'll check it out. So you'll see the number here, it says 990 should go down, and the storage in the battery should go up. Yep, there it goes. That's how the energy cell works. You just plug it into your power line, and the energy cell just pushes power into your system. It's like emergency battery. I'm going to fill up this one battery from it. But size-wise, it takes up a lot less space, so you could have some energy cells as emergency power if you ran out of juice. Bloop! And it's spent. Alright, so it was almost a full energy cell. I think it was a little short, and our battery is almost there, so... Eh, now I have a battery in the middle of the ship. <laughs> we can just uh, dismantle it. That was a good example. Dismantle it, we'll put it back, we'll get rid of our generator, and we'll probably just sell it. I have no use for it. Okay, we got a cannon. We'll match like we did the other side here. One space over. Power hooked up. And store a couple more cannon rounds if we ever get them with them. Okay, small tank, medium, medium, sewage. We don't need it, CO2, don't need it. No, no, no. It has to be installed. Alright, let's sell the rest of the stuff we don't need.
Oh, we're installing that guy. Let's not sell that. Okay. 117,000 profit. Uh, confirm. So here, this thing's melting precious metals. We have five. I think it gets up to 20. I don't know how much the smelting of the raw material goes into the actual material. But anyway, we'll come back here for that. Uh, FTL prepare jump. Moving right along. Yeah, see if we get any more goodies from the other derelict ship. Okay, he's waiting for the rest of the materials to get put onto the shuttle. How's another energy cell there? How about that? Trade. Oh, we can't sell it. Alright. We can't sell the generator either, can we? It doesn't show up on the list. It's not something you normally buy. Alright. I'll just go with it. Jump. Not too much data, we're pretty far away from the anomaly right now. I didn't even think about looking for hyperspace sensors if they had some more. We got room for like four more. Okay. Speed it up. Let's go check out what goodies this, this guy has for us. And lots of stuff. Let's go ahead and align for next jump. Now we're about there. Alright, what do we got out here? Thruster, small tank, is a docking port? Cool. Maybe I should put a docking port on the other side of my front of my ship. That'd be a good idea. And energy cells are popular here. How's a spacesuit? We could put a docking port up here, can't we? I think it's a double hole. <clears throat> well, let us do it. No. Yeah, I need to put interior space there in the back. I thought so. We'll put a docking port there. That'll save us from turning around the full amount the whole time. Thrusters. Do we have space for more thrusters? Got the drone bays here. Once you're blocking it. Might adjust the ship to extend it out a little bit for another thruster and then do the same thing over here. Yeah, I might do that. Just picked up another smelter. Ooh, an FTL drive. That's worth some money. Another large tank. <laughs> I really don't need a third large tank. Let's just install it to have it, and I'm not going to plug it into anything. Okay. Uh, yeah, normal speed. I'm just unloading stuff here. Bring it in, bring it in. More fuel and some bullets. Ah, an extra battery. Um, I don't know, we'll put it right here. Jump to the next place for the rescue. Oh yeah, I forgot about the hostile contact thing here. What is he? Oh, two fighters. Oh my gosh. We're not even going to bother with it. Not so hostile contact. The meteors are in this map are more hostile than those two fighters. So let's, uh, let's try this. Go this way. And then we'll turn into the ship here. Yeah, probably could have done that a little better. Oh, he's venting a lot. Okay, rotate on station here. As much as we can. Alright, a 
just... Ooh, that one got blown up right before it hit us. On the left side there, that was lucky. And we are docked. <clears throat> okay, 37 people, alright. Board, let's undock. And we'll head back to the shipyard and see what's going on. Now oh, we took a hit. Pretty jump. Let's turn off repair hole. Get these guys back on. We'll deal with it when we get back. We really need some cannon rounds. There are five shells right now. There we go. I guess we salvage those. Let's get these people off the boat. <clears throat> Let's see. Maybe we need to try to take out a weapons platform to increase our rating on combat. Wait, what is our rating on combat? Oh, we're at rank 3. <laughs> I was saying we need some more combat missions, but we're already ranked 3 from the combat I've done. Rank 2, humanitarian in industry, we're working on it. We did some smelting. Logistics, I don't know what I need to do for that. It's probably mining or something. Okay, we do have some precious metals here. 7. I don't know, is that enough to trade for? Uh, no. I'm going to sell that real quick. Uh, let's put our repair hull back on. See what that looked like, actually. So I'll fix this up, and then we'll see what we actually pay to repair. And we might redo our armor a little bit. Looks like there's a couple gaps. Uh, right here. I don't know we'll speed it. Plenty of railgun rounds. Plenty of bullets, it looks like. Yeah, we have a lot of bullets. We already bought all the fuel here, right? Yeah. Sell these energy cells. We already bought everything here, basically. There's just eight, eight water here we can buy. Which we don't really need. We'll buy two. Uh, smelter, we have an extra smelter now, right? Let's sell the extra one. Don't need it. Sell the FTL drive. Keep the thruster. And we'll sell that small tank. Profit. Okay, shipyard. We're going to mess with our hull a little bit. We are going to make this big enough to put another thruster here. Three. Keep the same angle, but we'll just push it back. Alright, interior. Let's do that. And we'll do the same thing on the other side. So let's install thruster. Okay, once we get the material, we'll have another thruster up here. Okay, shipyard, hull. Three happens to line up with the engine, end of the engine here, so that worked out pretty good. Don't have to make it look nice, it already looks nice. Boom, okay, so we have everything ready. We'll go ahead and put the cables there for the future thruster so it's all set. Nice, so that gives us a little bit more power. A little more turning power. Okay, everyone's done repairing. I'll turn that stuff off. Contracts 1's ready, we're still unloading. Yeah, in the middle of delivering, okay. And they're still repairing, I got on slow as well, okay. And drones fixy, fixy, fixy. Two, four, six, yeah. 
All right, so we've got a trade. We can see how much we need to repair now. Should be less. Yeah, just one structural item instead of two or three it was before. Repairs are done. Let's look at all these contracts again. So power game, five ships. That's five fighter launchers, which, again, I don't have that many cannon rounds. Cannons are what killed them before when I fought them. When I have real guns, I didn't have real guns before. I have them now, which will do some damage to them. They're not armored. I have more Gatling guns. Oh, no. I guess we'll do that. We're going to check out this weapons platform. We'll take it out. And we'll accept that one. Okay. So, combat, combat. We already, the hostiles are still there because we didn't do anything. Rescue mission there. Let's do that. We'll get close to the anomaly. I think that's kind of risky. Then we got to jump to this combat. That might get us close. We'll do that, and the next jump to the combat will be, should be close to the anomaly. We'll get a lot of data. Speaking of which, do they have hyperspace sensors? They do. Six, one, two, three, four. I think I have enough room to install. Yeah. Two more up here. I guess I put thrust could have put thrusters here, but eh. Oh, the docking port. Almost forgot that construction. Shipyard interior. We just need four squares right here. That'll match the other side of the ship. That'll be cool. There we go. That'll make things easier for rescues. All these sensors are slightly damaged. There's no way to repair these right now. The only way you can repair them is by dismantling them, then reinstalling them. Then they show up repaired. Ooh, this is tight. The water purifier is not going to fit there. I have to move those guys up a, a tick. Okay, well, you're going to see this. Watch, we're going to repair these. They're going to reinstall fully repaired. Okay. Uh, water purifier. And the pipes run down the bottom there, so that works. Yeah, wastewater. Um, like that. And the oxygen make it happener. Like so. Let's get rid of this pipe here. Those two and connect that back to the oxygen line and the wastewater line to there. And some cables to plug it all in. Make sure this is working. Yep, we're spinning. We are good. Uh, CO2 storage is slowly going down. That's good. All right, we are good. <laughs> we're good. Prepare a jump. Let's just double check where we're going. Good deal. Oh, I didn't know that. 0.4 data per second, 0.5. You can see it increasing as we get closer. 0.7.8. Alright. Uh, he just exploded. It looked like he just exploded. Uh, I don't know, that was weird. He just appeared. But now we have docking ports on both sides. Can we take advantage of it? Our new one? Nope. We're going to use our old one. And turn. Yeah, close enough. Break. That was not too bad. I'll connect. Not drifting. Yeah, we're good. Looks 
explode in three minutes. Coming in, there's a ladder heading down here. You can't seem to disappear up it. Okay, we got everybody. All right, undock. Sector map, we're going to check out the... Oh, unreachable now. I was worried about that. Oh, wow. Ha! Huh. And we can't get there. Oh, my gosh. The sector is blocking us from jumping there. Our systems. NG-19 is blocking our jump to this colony. Oh, we get so much data if we did that. Can we go here and then make that jump? I was worried about these. They're just a little too far off. If we jump here, will that thread the needle? It should. Let's try going there. Hopefully we, we don't lose too much ground. And can still make that jump to that colony. I'd like to be right on the edge of the anomaly like that. We'll get a bunch of data. I mean, is it a wind up? Short jump. But we're getting a lot of data from the short jump. Alright. Yes. Alright. We can clear that. I was worried we were going to lose a little bit of ground. Per jump. Checking supplies. We look good. Nice deal. I am curious. I'm going to slow this down. Jump. I'll slow down after the screen comes back. What is this showing? 1.3 data per second. We're draining our power grid, but they should be okay after the engines spool up. Let's go to normal speed. It's getting closer. Hope it doesn't. Hope it doesn't consume us before we get out of it, because we'll lose a lot of data that way. <laughs> Just getting bigger. That's all. That's all there. We're not even halfway yet. Right on the edge is getting closer. <laughs> Obviously. Five data per second. Look at how much it's increasing now. Oh, right on the edge. This is awesome. Man, this is normal speed. Ten data per second. It's increasing even more. Yeah, that is huge. Thirteen. I was going back down now. I'm getting away from it. Plus 7,000 data. We hit 10,000 data, people. Ten million space bucks. Nice. The next one's a hundred thousand data. I don't think we can reach that. <laughs> cool. Second time I've done this. And doing it the same way. Let's deliver these guys. A sector map. We're getting a lot of data when we jump out of here too, just from being right on the edge. But it's not going to last very long. We're going to outrun it. That's cool. Good timing on that. I got lucky there. Um, trade. What do we got here for trade? Four hundred percent price on all the like, stuff you need to get out of here. Survive, but everything else is eighty percent off. Heavily discounted. Uh, we'll buy. Batteries. We should buy these sensors. We'll put them somewhere. We need another thruster. Now let's just double check there's nothing we can sell. Like, can we sell compost? Do we have any compost to sell? Nope. Get like 400 bucks for it. Okay. Install. We need our thruster. Put it up here. Oh, I didn't put the cable all the way over. So sensors, where can we put some sensors? No, not quite. What is this piece? Oh, you forget to put an angle one there? Yeah. The hole's a bit messed up there. Because I can put one there. This square shouldn't be there. 
and I don't have a shipyard here to adjust that. I only get one sensor and another one over here. The bad thing is you can only install these on the flat. No angles. Ah, that's a bummer. I'll have to fix this part of the ship. Okay, batteries. We're just going to install more batteries up here. Back to normal speed. Oops. And that's it, right? Generator, hyperspace sensor, can't do that. And then thruster. Oh, I did a sensor there. No, this should be a thruster. I thought I had the thing right. Yeah. Power's in the middle of the thruster. Uh, okay. So I have two sensors I can still install. I'm not going to remove these thrusters to put them in. Yeah, we'll just deal with it. Okay. What do we have for contracts here? Transport transports. Yeah, there's no way I'm winning that combat. More transport. Maybe we should just take this like four hundred thousand dollar mission transport. Destination is two sector jumps away in sector three. No thanks, that's too far. No wonder it's worth so much money. One jump away in sector two, so I'm about to jump to the next sector anyway. There's no time limit. Let's go ahead and accept this. He's gonna go here. There's nothing in this sec this system here, and then we're just gonna jump right out of here. So not a big deal. Uh, let's get this. Oh, they got plugged in. Anybody else missing power? Now it looks like we're good. Extra batteries, so we have no issues with power now. Not that we had any before. Okay. Um, let's jump. Let's data increase real quick. Eh, it's totally going away. We get too far away from that. That was nice. We're getting like 15 data per second before for all these items. Still got a thousand data. Wait for this to cool down and re, re spool it up. We're getting low on fuel, so the next jump in the next sector, we'll have to get a bunch of fuel. Jump tank sector, all right. Uh, ludicrous speed, engage. Oh, what's going on here? We were at a place with a shipyard. Yep. There's a derelict up here, that's cool. Three shipyards in this map, oh my gosh. And a colony on the exit. I gotta transport the passengers all the way to the end. That sucks. All right, um, we're gonna go there next. After we do a little work here. Yeah, I can't do any of those. All right, I will check that in a minute. But first things first, shipyard. Let's fix our hull on our ship here. Do three, and this was supposed to be an angle to match the other side. So install sensor. And oh, this gap right there needs filled in. See through it. 
Um, I could straighten this out and put the sensor on either side, either side there. I can do that. The interior. Yeah, we'll do that. And do they have another hyperspace sensor we can buy? They do. Let's buy one. Do they have cannon rounds? They have 13 shells. We could buy all those. For sure. Bullets. Oh, we have a lot of bullets, actually. Let's get up to 40 and leave it at that. Fuel, we're going to buy all the fuel. Food, we're going to buy a decent amount of food. We have a lot of people on board right now, so we're going to chew it up. A little bit of water. Let's buy all of it. It's cheap. It's going to take a minute to do all the loading of that stuff. So is there anything else we want? I'm going to buy one more battery just to even things out on our ship. I think we could confirm. And these asteroid resource missions are where the money's at in this game. 630,000. You get a few of these and you make a few million dollars pretty quickly. Rogue fighters. Yeah, we'll do that. Do some combat missions here. We didn't do the weapons platform the last one because it didn't come up as the place we can get to. System 30, 26. 29, 28. So these are all different places. Let's just... Where is System 30 at? We're going to go to 29 next. So who's on 29? And 30 is... Way down here. Yeah, 29 sector map. Ah, wrong button. Contracts. He's at System 30. He's at 26. That's a bummer. He's at 29, though. I'll accept that. Five ships. Uh, we'll accept these other two. They're different places. Just if we get a chance to go there, we'll try blowing one up and see what that does for us. There's no cargo. Or oh, we don't want any cargo. I've collected 11,000 data. 340 civilians from Doom Planets. 20 permanent residents on my ship. 20 crew. Okay. That's too slow. Get that guy installed. The other battery up here to make this even. Should I build some rooms around this? We'll push this door over here and then make this a wall. I don't know. Don't really know how I want to design this yet. Do it like that. I'd have to put the wall right through here. Okay, yeah, we're gonna do that. Uh, interior. <laughs> Things when you build holes and stuff in the ship when people are walking around, sometimes uh, you block their path. So he's just stuck there. Well, that's cleared out. Oh my gosh. Okay, guy. Get that battery installed up there. <laughs> Install all these walls in his way. He was probably path to go here before I put the wall up. Then he got stuck trying to find his way. Like that. Put three more doors in. Do they have more doors here? 
Let's buy them all. Oh, he just left too. Dang. If I'd have bought those when he was still docked, we would have just got the items for free. I shouldn't say for free. He wouldn't re transport things. Alright. Construction. Not sure I want to do the room layout down here yet. I might make what I have up here down here and then just put things into place. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we're going to do this combat next. 26, was that one of the stations? Or was that the other fighters? 20 and 30. Oh, i got to check that real quick. Yeah, scroll down. was system 30 right which is one we're not going to and then 26 yeah that's one we're going to do that one we're going to check out this weapons platform let's try not to get killed here uh, shipyard armor this all looks good actually oh there's something there good there doesn't charge you if you're not doing anything new. Yep, zero. Zero, no damage. I know we took some hit down here. Yep. And we just changed our hull up here. On the corners. Alright, FTL. Let's do it, man. be some hostile contact. Yeah, there he is. Let's just point this way. I'm about to move a little farther forward. Once I see the rail guns engage the target, then we're going to turn this off. We'll go to park it. And then put it on fast forward as he shoots them. Hmm. Any second now. Oh, blinked up. Oh, I forgot they, they shoot off fighters. <laughs> he had a real gun. I mean, all these cannon rounds. Just wasted. I have a lot of fighters come out of that station. So, two fighters got past the uh, main guns. Don't really have Gatling guns facing forward or straight out the back, just the sides. Yeah, another bunch of wasted rounds of cannon. Oh, that one got him, alright. These guys have a lot of health. They have 4,000, we've only done 49 damage. He's got all his armor, so the railgun rounds take some time to get do some damage. I thought these were cannon, cannons in the middle and then Gatling guns on the outside, but I could be wrong. We have... Uh, 264 slugs, so let's speed this up and see how much this will take too long. Maybe we should just buzz by this guy and fire some of our cannons we got at him. Getting close for cannon fire, though. A little closer, our nose cannons are about to reach. Those will do some more damage. Yeah, there we go. Now you see the damage climb quick. These cannons are just fast firing and do a lot of damage. We gotta get in close. Okay, now we're out of cannon rounds on those cannons in the front. These guys are out now. 
Yeah, we didn't even knock him down to half health. Oh, wait, we got a few more rounds. Okay, now we're out of ammo. Zero. Help the rest of these slugs go. Let's speed this up. While this is happening, let's go to the map. We're gonna do... Oh wait, we're gonna go check out the derelict ship, that's right. Just have to blow this guy up. We'll see if we get any goodies there. And we should have enough ammo to kill this guy. Explody. Eighty percent damaged, twenty percent left. You see, sometimes the hits don't seem to do any real damage to them. Very little. Yeah. Nothing. 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 Then damage. Okay, here we go. Here's the end of it. Maybe. Come on, do some damage. There we go. Let's pause it. I think we get some supplies out of this. Yeah, we do. Gather salvage. And while they're doing that, we'll go ahead and align our FTL. Oh, point the other way. Fuels on a spacesuit. Alright, real gun rounds have replenished what we spent killing this guy. More bullets, hopefully we get some cannon rounds. Some precious ore here. Let's go ahead and turn on reagents. And gather that. And there's precious metals there too. There's some money just sitting there waiting for us to get. That's awesome. There's a traffic jam here at the drone ports. A few bottles of water. I don't have a loader to take water, but we'll just save it on the ship to use, to consume. Oh, I forgot there's a bug in the game with this. I still had the uh, shipyard selected, so I still get the menu for the shipyard, even though I jumped away and there's no shipyard here. A little bit of a bug. So install, so it doesn't look like we got anything else. Just some supplies here. Cool deal. Too bad we didn't get any shells. That'd be nice to get some of those back. Okay, let's uh, turn this off. They're just getting scrap metal. Alright, you're good. How's that? A few more bullets. Yep, a few more bullets. We got a lot of bullets now for the Gatling guns. And this ship could use a rear facing Gatling gun or two. Maybe I can tweak this tail here a little bit. One pair of gallon guns facing the rear. And I don't have anything facing the front, so maybe adjust the nose here for a pair of gallon guns or something. Alright, everyone's on board. We're good. Okay, I'm guessing there's just like a pair of fighters or something silly here. Yep. Nah, let's go take them out, I guess. And then we can salvage this guy. Fighting the camera movement. Alright, let's just take out these guys. I'm surprised they're not even engaging me. Okay, good deal. Alright. I'm leaving the drones in our dust here. Full thrust. And we're good. And where are we going to go next? We're going to go back to the shipyard here. Yeah, we'll go back there.
More railgun rounds, the energy cell shells, cells, ugh. cannon rounds, that's good. Fuel. Decent supplies here, that's nice. Some precious metal. He's smelting anymore? No, but we have some precious metals to sell. I'll give some more money. Getting drone jam at the ports. Wait on people to come grab supplies so they can move along. It would be nice in the future if they had like a device where the drones can drop off and it's just a machine that pulls the stuff in the... puts the materials on a conveyor belt or something. Or something that gets just supplies in to not have to rely on this, the crew to manually do this operation here. Especially with mining, that would make things a lot cooler. Has some setup where they just drop it off and the machine pulls it in and puts the material into the smelter, the smelter takes it, you know, smelts. Waste treatment machine, alright. Oh, an extra reactor. We don't need it. We'll go ahead and install it. I mean, these are idling high enough where we can have another reactor and it's not going to hurt anything. It won't be wasteful. Okay, let's get the rest of this stuff done, people. Could use another drone bay for this traffic jam. Oh, I really need more people, actually, to handle this. Oh, another engine, too. That was a profitable spot. He says blocked. Shouldn't be. Should be pushing everything in the CO2 tank. Oh, I'll put blocked. Did we screw something up here? Oh, we just have so much oxygen in the. Oh, okay, because we picked up some oxygen bottles. And they're putting in the atmosphere, and our tank is full. We got rid of all our tanks, didn't we? Picked up a small one, so we put. Uh, Small one here. We'll do that. We need to get the excess oxygen into a tank or something, otherwise we can't scrub. He'll fill up the CO2 tank, and then we'll just extra CO2 go in the air because he can't uh, go through this chain. All right, everyone's on board. We're gonna jump. All right, so the tank is installed. It's filling it way too fast. Already 60%. Alright. And we'll do a rescue mission. I don't really care to do the weapons platform because it's not, it's kind of boring. Rogue fighters is, uh, sure. I want to fight that one guy. They have a fighter craft, like a large fighter that does like a figure eight attack against you. That guy's a bit harder to fight. I haven't seen that mission in a while though. Okay, let's do those. Trade, we've been here before, so there's nothing new. Oh, sell that energy cell. I'll buy a little more fuel. Don't need any bullets. Uh, buy some railgun slugs to replenish what we spent. Blowing up that platform. Okay, precious metals. 45,000. I mean, we can sit on this till the price goes up and sell it for even more, but that's a lot of money. Repair damage. That would cover our expenses. So combat, combat rescue. For data collection, we could jump back. I eh, can't get there. Back just to get closer to the anomaly. But we're going to go to this combat, combat rescue, combat, and shipyard. Something along those lines. OK, 
Okay. All right. Trade's finished. Why is he still attached? Oh, we're not waiting anything, so let's go. Loop. Hostile contact. Battle station. Oh, we got one. Yeah, one round of cannon. Two, three, four rounds. Yeah, just fighter craft. Let's uh, hold our fire. Actually, let's not hold our fire. Let's let our railguns go ahead and take pot shots at them. Oh, they go. F I didn't realize this. They go faster once they start engaging. One guy left. Now we should turn the other way. Oh, there we go. Double railgun took him out. Alright, and we'll go do this combat rescue. Do it. Okay, the rescue's here. Do we have a time limit on the rescue? No. No time limit, so let's go kill these fighters real quick. He got lucky for a minute. Okay, they're engaging. Let's turn sideways with the gavelin guns. Do some damage there. Yeah. Uh, low throttle, rotate around, let it push us into the port here. Okay, well, close. Almost there, and we're docked. 31 people. Oh, we're going to get to the next rank, maybe? All right, rank three. Uh, rank four in combat now, too. Okay, everyone's unloaded, or offloaded, uh, loaded, what do you want to call it? map. Go to this last combat, which should... No, we're not going to do that. That's going to be a ship, or a station. Let's go to the shipyard. Actually, one more thing. Let's go to the map. Unreachable. Yeah, we're going to this shipyard. Let's see if we get there. About 12,000 data. We need to get it close to the anomaly to get another big data boost, too. Looks like we're about out of things we can do on this map. In this sector here. Yeah, deliver these guys. Other combat missions we can do? Pirate gang. Four ships, so four fire launchers. We'll take that. Uh, I'll do, I don't know. Doing so many rescue missions, we don't need the money. Uh, sector map. Oh, back there. Huh. We can do that.
All these people on board we can't get rid of till we get to the end. Alright, trade. Fuel, plus 50. Let's sell these two items. I guess that's the price. It must not increase or decrease with this thing here. So let's go ahead and sell these. Profit. More profit. Engine. Yeah, we don't want to sell these here. We'll sell them at the beginning of the next sector when they're worth more money. Confirm so they can pick up all that stuff. Yeah, we got the combat aligned. In this one, we're not going to buy any other ships. We're just going to stick with the one we got. I'm getting rid of all the stuff. The bad port, part about having storage over here and docking port over here just takes forever for them to walk through the ship. They didn't have any cannon rounds, right? They do almost uh, buy these real quick without the shuttles docked. Almost got out of here without buying more ammo. Oh my gosh. That would have been bad. That would been a dumb thing to do. Um, plenty of bullets. Can't buy them anyway. Real good. We'll buy the five they have. Mine as well. Okay. Put it back. Double time. Triple time it. Let's increase our spacesuit storage around this tank. Oh, actually, put it over the tank. Ah, we're all traded up. I don't know why this guy's still docked. He should have left already. And. Actually, hang on a second. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We'll just do it. Short jump, short jump, uh, stranded ship, and we have fighter launchers. Does this guy have a time limit? He does not. So we'll go ahead and do the combat first. What's this stuff here in the middle? Uh, wish I could disassociate my the camera from the ship when he's rotating sometimes. Is this uh, scrap metal? It is. Hmm. Okay. Oh, we're saying hello. Hello to the locals. These guys have real guns in the front. Just one real gun. Yep, and they're answering back. Let's uh, throttle up. Let's turn sideways with the Gatling guns. Shoot at these fighters instead of wasting our bigger stuff on them. Let's go a little faster too. Okay, realign the front this way. Stop firing the cannons at this fighter. Shoot the craft, the big ones. Oh, this guy's damaged. Hard turn. U turn. Ha <laughs> ha. Same with this guy over here. I'll slow it down. Cans are what take these guys out real quick. And cans take everything out real quick. Well, a 52% damage. We got it, the hull's breached. Come on, get them, Gatling guns. 
Alright, Galleons did their work. We are peppered up. 57% damage, he's at 7% damage. Let me see if we can change that real quick for him. There we go, good night. Uh, we're already doing salvage on these ships. Pulling supplies, ammunition, railgun rounds. Should be the same story over here. Yep, ammunition, railgun rounds. We took some damage there for sure. Look at us. 60% 60 60 damaged. It's a lot of damage to these little guys. Okay, we're doing hull, repair, hull repairs. Can they already gather the salvage down here? No, let's do uh, repair off. We don't want to gather the salvage. We'll do repairs later. Let's get the salvage and we go get these people off the ship and then we can do repairs then. Uh, let's speed it up. 13,000 fuel. ton of oxygen. A lot of food. Why is everyone wearing suits? Because uh, we have an oxygen problem. And they went too low on oxygen at one point. That's really weird. We have 114,000 oxygen. I'm confused. Do we need another air duct to help vent out all that excess oxygen we got? 88%, 89%. Something must have happened. I know we have a full load of people here, 40 people, and we're about to increase that. So that's not a good sign. This is going up, though. I'm not sure what happened there. Have they gathered everything? Traffic jam for these guys to get them in. Ah, another oxygen bottle. Okay, everyone's putting their suits back. Everything's good. All right, let's uh, go ahead and get to the ship over here. The drones will catch up. Getting left in the engine exhaust. Oh, more supplies! They ran out to get more supplies. Uh, hang on a second. Did I already rescue this guy? There's no port. <laughs> I think I already did this mission. I'm not paying attention. There's no docking bay on him. Uh, if there's no docking bay, you've already docked him. I guess, or, yeah. Huh. Okay. So I guess when these guys get back, we'll just jump out of here. We're here. Can we make it? Let's go over. And we jump here first, then down here. Anomaly will get, anomaly will get closer. Let's just go there. Yeah, everyone's on board, so we're good to go. I picked up two more docking ports. Okay. I don't think we can trade for those either. Uh, let's do repair hull. So 16 items here. I'll we'll have to remember that. See how much we reduced from the drones doing it ourselves. It's a lot. But there's not a way to bottle oxygen and then sell it. Because I have a lot of oxygen. It'd be nice to sell it. If I needed to. That's uh, not sell any of these things. It's too expensive or too cheap. Sector map. Yeah, we're gonna go here next to get right next to the anomaly to get a little more data. What can we do for contracts? 
armor tugs is just one. Should we try that? Just fighting one of them? I think we should try it. What system is he in? System 33. He's way out here. So we go here, then there. Yeah, we can do that. I don't. How many cannon rounds do we have? 17 shells. It's probably not enough. But yeah, screw it. Let's do it. A tug, one ship, system 33, except. We can try our hand at it. If we, if we do it, we do it. If we don't, we don't. Just keep an eye on our uh, health when we fight them. Make sure we don't accidentally die. Okay, let's speed this up. And we're going to have to buy fuel while we're sitting here doing repairs. It's going to take forever. Uh, trade. We can afford it. So let's go ahead and buy it. Anything else we need. We're good, we're good on food. Food, water, O2 is all good. I mean, real gun slugs, 32 is good. Bullets we have a ton of. I think we're fine there. Well, do they have two more Gatling guns here? They do have two more. We'll make our ship just a little bit heavier and alter it a little bit more. And point a rear-facing Gatling gun on each side right back here. Next to the engines. So we'll remove our armor. We have one, two, three, four. Let's go five wide. It's going to make the back look a little weird. And then interior. Let me do that and then the gallon gun right here. Okay. Uh, trade. And we'll go ahead and buy. We don't need any more bullets. This is a ton of bullets. So we'll do the same thing on this side. whole point there. Alright. And some rear facing galling guns. Will help out a little bit when fighters come up and shoot our engines out. So our strategy against the armored beast will be to try to fly around him and shoot his engines. Try to. Hey, our ship's not flashing red. We're going to put some more armor on this guy, too. It's going to slow us down, though. That's the bad, that's the give and take. And, I mean, as big as it is, I could use another engine or two to make it faster. Okay, so he's going to trade. What was it, like 16 before to do all the repairs? Now we're 8, so half them out. Not that this is expensive. I'm just curious how much the drones could do versus buying it. So they about halved our cost. Alright, so the rest is getting repaired. Let's think how much armor we want to do. They have real guns. Just do a little heavier armor. I think it's going to slow us down. But, they're definitely going to shoot us with a real gun. And we can close in on them. So repair our armor. And let's armor up this section here on each side. Even more than we did before. How far back we go about there. And we'll rearmor this since we just put those new sections in.
Okay, this will be pretty risky. I don't know, we just slowed our ship down. So we're going to go there and then there. Let's see how well this works. All these bullets we have. Okay, he's almost powered up. I'll start putting bullets on him. Alright, FTL, jump. Speed it up. Okay, 13,000 data. So we have for contracts. Can we do any of these? Probably don't want to do that. No, we'll skip all the contracts. Double check our trade. Oh, that's right, we just sold the precious metal here earlier. Okay. Oh, we got energy cells we can get rid of. Yeah. And some compost. Alright, wait. Oh, we have deuterium we can sell too. Yeah, we'll sell that. 57,000? Oh my gosh, that stuff's expensive here. Confirm. Alright, sector map. Combat's we're going to get a bunch of data right off the bat, and then we're going to see if we die. <laughs> Will be interesting. All right, let's speed this up, get this stuff offloaded. Sometimes we could buy a tiny fighter and put him in the way of the bad guy, let the bad guy shoot at him, and then go take out the bad guy. All right, FTL. But we're not going to do that. We still have these people on here, 20 passengers on board. All right, here we go, fingers crossed. Look at that data. 15. Extra 2,000. Okay, hostile contact. Where's this guy at? Behind us. Alright, cool. Let's uh, put it on hold real quick. Let's see if he turns at us first. Sometimes they don't move until you shoot them. So if I shoot them from long range, let's go this way. And he'll turn towards us. I don't know if he's gonna turn. I wanna get behind him and then shoot his engines. He's moving forward slowly. Well, I usually don't take aim at anything on the enemy, I just let the computer do it. But this time I'm going to slow it down and target both of his engines with my railguns. Or he's got three engines. Two of the outside engines with my railgun, then target the middle one. Okay. Let's slow down. So these two on the right side will... Can we do it? Target that. And the two on the other side. I'll target that. See if that works. A little off, but we'll try it. And we'll just turn towards them and see what happens. We might need to speed up a little bit catch him. Oh no, yeah, we're in range. But the guns are not spooling up yet. should see a bar going up here. Why are they not firing? Oh, because I'm holding fire, you dummy. There we go. Oh, oh! He got his attention. We didn't damage anything though. Did I just change the side of the guns? Let's try to hit this one here. Yeah, I swapped them around. Oh, oh well. Come on, normal speed. 
Get another round off before he turns around all the way. Ah, crap. Alright. Auto everything. Punch it. I'm gonna fly right through him and take a U-turn. Seven percent damage. And he's turning to engage his cannons on us. Hopefully, we just fly right through him. Actually, we'll turn back this way a little bit. Hull breach. Yeah. Ugh, taking a lot of damage. Don't get back here behind his cannons. Oh, shoot! 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 I should have slowed down. Oh, we're not going to make it. We're not going to make it. Ah. I shouldn't have killed the thrust. I should have stayed right behind him. Wah, wah, wah. Okay. But we can load an autosave. Wait. So abandon game, load game. The autosave is when you jump into the system. So we'll do that. I'll try this one more time. Okay, so he's out there. Put on hold. I remember put on hold this time. Let's speed it up, actually. So, maybe I can get the engines. If I can hit these engines and destroy them in the first shot and slow them down, then he can't turn as fast. And that will basically make him a sitting duck. Okay, engine. Okay, is that okay. All right, all right. Slow down. Okay, squared on that. I think the la Oh, these are armor. That's right. I should put all four of them right in the middle here. Try this again. I think I was just missing these before. Okay, fire. Let's see, come on, kill him. Oh, that looks like it did some damage. This one's red. Yeah. I don't know if he's damaged enough, but probably not. Can we get another round off? Okay, let's put these on auto. We'll try this again. So that engine is damaged. He's not, you can see there's no engine thrust coming out of it. Like the other two. So, that's something. Come on, cannons, do some damage to him. He's got to get behind him here. And he's definitely going slower now. My gallon guns tear him a new one. I don't want to get on the other side of him. All his guns are good on that side. There we go. Light up his rear. Stay on the side of him. Stay out of his cannons. Yeah, that was what I meant to do the first time. <laughs> Good deal. And we'll turn on salvage. Oh, it's already there. I never turned it off. There are some supplies to gather. Plumes of salvage there, plume of uh, scrap metal. We are, <laughs> both the drone ports are damaged, so they're getting repaired now. One cannon around left. We'll hide an explosion, explosion plume. Ah, uh, fun stuff. Alright, well, second time was better than the first. 
the last jump here in the sector. Okay, are these guys gathering salvage? Or let's not repair the hole. Let's get, get the salvage and get out of here. Well, that worked out better. Killed the bad guy. Oh, you turn. There's some precious metal there, but I don't want to deal with it because I can grab all the scrap instead. Okay, get all the drones in here, we'll jump out of here. I have to sell these metal ingots and such. Almost there. Three, two. One more drone out there. There we go. I'll data pile up real quick. Alright, contracts. We finally get these people off this ship. Deliver. Alright. From wreck ship, this is in the next sector. And the next sector. Alright. Well, I've been doing this for two hours. I think that's good. We can call this a night. Hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks everybody for uh, staying with me if you watched this far. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Would appreciate it. And see you in the next one. Alright. Enjoy your rest of your day everyone. Bye.